Another milestone moment in the restoration of the Litchfield Canal. The land alongside Falkland Road has been transferred from Staffordshire County Council to the Trust. This is a real good example of the support that the County Council has given to the Trust over the years and shows real good forward thinking. When the developments took place in this area, the bypass was required and the County Council took possession of land for the bypass, but they allowed also sufficient room for the canal here so that at a stage when we were ready they would transfer land from County Council to us so that we can build the canal. That canal will go all the way through to Birmingham Road. At Birmingham Road roundabout the County Council have already built the canal culvert that goes underneath the roundabout so we've got a nice easy run through here. Yeah, this is wonderful to be involved as a county councillor for this area. I've seen the development of the Canal Trust over a number of years and this is yet more um, stages being developed. And it's quite good to see it happening inch by inch, mile by mile as we go through uh, the Trust area. Because I've been involved for the City Council, the District mm -hmm. Council and the County. Yeah. And all along the way, I mean, I, I live on um, Boracop, so all along the way there's been partnerships struck up. Yeah and foresight on behalf of the Canal Trust and also the three councils yeah, to yeah. all recognise what needs to happen. Yeah. I know there's bits of land that the city has had to um, pass over as well. The district has worked closely where yeah. it's been involved and latterly on this piece of land yeah. it's the counties. Yeah. Hmm. Great to be passing the land over. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> it's, it's very difficult for people to imagine uh, the canal until they start seeing things being built and then it becomes very evident. Well, each piece of land that we're able to take ownership of means that we can progress the canal further. It gives us the more ready ability to get planning consents and it gives us the impetus to keep moving away. You know, our, our challenge is to bring the canal into Litchfield and through Litchfield as quickly as we can get it. Um, that's obviously dependent on getting the land, getting the necessary funding, uh, but we are working very hard specifically on this section of land through Litchfield, joining up the three development areas that have been allocated. That's Dean Slade, um, South River Litchfield, Cricket Lane at the far end. The canal will provide a blue-green link through all of these developments, enabling people to come from the development into Litchfield without having to use um, major roads. That was the one thing that really stood out for me when I saw yep. some of the new houses coming. Um, the, the people who come into those houses, when they see there's a canal right next door, they're going to say, isn't it wonderful that somebody's built a canal in my house? Yeah, there's been a lot of interest from residents on Dean Slade and St John's um, asking how soon is it going to be before mm. it's in water because sure. it's a great facility and, and actually having a canal next to your house does wonders for the value of your house as I'm well. I'm sure. Yeah. You know, so, yeah. I, I know a number of people that have said wasn't it wonderful to have the start of the canal during lockdown because it was such a, a treat to be able to walk Borough Lock and go in either direction. Yeah. And this section here, this, this gets an awful lot of use at Fossway because you can start on this side, go all the way to Fossway Lane and then back on the other I've, side. I've done it. Yeah. <laughs> and you, you see people all of the time in, in, in enjoying the, a bit of countryside and, you know, it's, it's what it's about a mile, mile and a half circuit for people yeah, from the estate. Yeah. So, you know, it's, it's a benefit for people even now. And ov obviously we're, we're talking together about how we can improve the environment on this section here with the monies that you've got available um, through the County Council for local improvements and stuff. Mm. We're also talking with uh, Litchfield District Council uh, and the, the new person there, Alex Lane, who's looking to bring the Heathlands all back to use as here and mm -hmm. up the corner. So everybody's working together to make a real difference. Great. Yeah. Thank you very much.